Welcome back to episode five of my do-it-yourself whole home DVR setup with a TiVo. To watch any of the previous episodes, click on the images below. In this episode, I take a stock TiVo that has a 500 gig hard drive and can record 75 hours of HD, and I replace it with a three terabyte hard drive that I bought on Amazon for around a hundred bucks, increasing the recording capacity to over 450 hours of HD. That's six times the original recording capacity for only a hundred dollars. Let's get started. These are the tools that I have ready. I'm going to replace a TiVo Romeo stock 500 gig hard drive with a three terabyte hard drive. I have a Phillips head screwdriver, a flathead, and Torx T9 is the one we're going to be needing. So I'm going to put the T9 one in here. I'm going to open my package from Amazon. This has the three terabyte hard drive inside it. This is the hard drive. It is a Western Digital 3.0 EURX. I will get a link in the description for it. First thing we're gonna do is turn the TiVo around. And there's one torque screw right here in the back. And we're going to unscrew it. To get these side ones out, as you can see, there are three clips on each side. The first one was pretty easy to get out. To get the rest of them though, you kind of squeezed in the middle and bent it so that the plastic curved a little bit, and then the side ones popped out. And now on this side, the same thing. Now it lifts up, and there is a, it's, it's, you can see there's a clip there that went on the front. Okay, so I'm gonna set this aside. You can see the existing hard drive in there. We're going to take it out. Looks like one, two, three screws holding it in. And it is the T9 again. Set them aside, because we're gonna need them to put the new hard drive back in. We're going to lift the hard drive out and flip it around like this. That seems to be the easiest way to get the power out. Comes right out. I'm going to set it down next to the other one. And notice these brackets, one of them is reverse than the other one. So we need to make sure we put it on the right way, okay? So I'm gonna put it on right next to each other so we can see the two hard drives. Okay, for these screws on the side, they look like they're a little larger than a T9. I found a small screwdriver on my Leatherman that actually fit inside of it and did the trick for getting these screws out. So I'm just gonna get these guys out now. I could just find a small screwdriver somewhere, but I found this quickly and it works. Okay, now I'm gonna line it up with this one here. So it went on like that. I'm gonna go ahead and put this onto this guy now. Now I'm gonna get the other side here. Notice this one's on opposite from the other one, it's on upside down. Okay, so now I'm gonna mount it on this one the same way. Goldfish. <laughs> it's my daughter helping me out, who is going to be very happy to have six times the recording capacity for all her Disney shows. Okay, now I'm going to flip this around and plug it in. And now, put it back in. The T9 bit, same one I used to take them out. Got the three to put in. And one more it goes in right there. 
I'm going to put the TiVo back on. So I'm gonna start with the front, make sure it's centered. And fits right in. Clips on the side, make sure they get all the way in. And take my Torx T9 on the back here. After replacing the hard drive, you just plug the TiVo in and it boots up on its own. It recognizes that there's a new hard drive, formats it, and then brings you to the main TiVo menu. There's nothing else you have to do. So easy. Check that out. 477 hours of HD recording. The stock one only had 75. That's pretty awesome. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel for more techie videos. Thanks for watching.